Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn how to draw flowchart to find sum of given digit or sum of given number. Here we have to draw flowchart. Flowchart is always start start with start statement. It is writing within a oval shape. Start. Next we have to read input values. Input values is writing within a parallelogram shape. Within that we have to read input value. Here we have to find sum of given digit right. Means we have to read a number that is n. Next. Next we have to declare sum value. Declaration is done within a rectangular shape. Within that we have to declare sum is equal to 0. Initially sum is equal to 0 right. So here we have to declare sum is equal to 0. It is writing within a rectangular shape. Next we have to start calculation. First here we have to find reminder. Reminder of n. Reminder is equal to n module 10. Here calculation is writing within a rectangular shape. Here we have to first, first of all we have to find n module 10. Reminder value of n. Next we have to calculate some value that is using formula sum is equal to sum plus reminder sum plus reminder see here if you want to find sum of 125 here n value is equal, consider n value is equal to 125 First here we have to find reminder. Reminder is equal to 125 module 10. What is here? Here reminder is 5 right? Reminder value is 5. Next we have to calculate sum. Sum is equal to sum plus reminder. Initially sum is equal to 0 right? Here we have to find sum plus reminder. 0 plus 5. Sum value become 5. Next we have to calculate n value n is equal to n divided by 10 here n is equal to n divided by 10 means our n value is 125 right 125 divided by 10 here what is the value of n n value become 12 here we have to check if n value greater than 0 if n value is greater than 0, if this condition is true, we have to calculate reminder again. If we n value greater than 0, here n value is 12, right? 12 is greater than 0. It again calculate reminder here. Reminder is equal to n module 10. Here n value is 12, right? 12, right? 12 module 10 here reminder become 2 right next we have to calculate sum value sum is equal to sum plus reminder what is the sum value here 5 right 5 plus reminder reminder value is 2 so here sum become 5 plus 2 7 next we have to calculate n value what is the value of n 12 right 12 divided by 10 n value become 1 here it check the n value greater than 0 1 is greater than 0 yes it is true it again check again calculate reminder reminder is equal to n module 10 it means n value is 1 right 1 module 10 here reminder become 1 right next we have to calculate some value sum is equal to sum plus reminder what is the sum value 7 right 7 plus reminder value 1 sum value become 8 next we have to calculate n value n is equal to n divided by 10 what is the value of n 1 right 1 divided by 10 n value becomes 0 if n greater than 0 0 greater than 0 it falls right 
false next we have to print output value here some value is stored in some write here we have to print some value what is the sum value here 8 right 1 plus 2 plus 5 that is 1 plus 2 plus 5 it become 8 here we have to print some value output value C is writing within a parallelogram shape next we have to stop flowchart using stop statement so guys this is the flowchart to find sum of d1 digit it is start with start statement next we have to read n value next we have to declare sum is equal to 0 next we have to calculate reminder using formula n module 10 next sum is equal we have to calculate sum value that is using formula sum plus reminder next we have to calculate n value that is n is equal to n divided by 10 if next we have to check if n greater than 0 here comparison is done within a diamond shape if n value greater than 0 if this condition is true we have to again go to this stage if this condition is false we have to print some value output value is always writing within a parallelogram shape next we have to stop flowchart using stop statement so guys this is the flowchart to find sum of d1 digit if you like my video please like and subscribe my channel Thank you for watching. All the best.